really like coconut. Lockdown's given me a chance to experiment a little bit with my cooking, and I've found that coconut milk can turn a good dal into a spectacular one. Coconut in Thai green curry, coconut in flapjack, all great. Even raw coconut. But have you ever tried to eat a whole coconut in one sitting? It's even more laborious than the famous Jacob's Cream Cracker Challenge. On the 9th of May 2005, Ambrose Mendy ate three cream crackers in... 34.78 seconds at the studios of LBC in London. That's the current world record, but I'd think that even Ambrose would struggle to eat a whole coconut in just one sitting. No matter how good the first mouthful, after three or four bites, the taste is cloying, repetitive. It's lost its flavour. Now there's an academic lesson to be learnt from coconuts, believe it or not. How many of us have sat down at the start of one of these lockdown days and committed to writing the whole of that English essay, or working through the maths textbook, or doing my media project. No matter how full of energy and enthusiasm we are in the first hour of these big tasks, into the second hour, our attention might start to drift. At the end of the third hour, you might begin to realise you spent more time on Instagram than you'd intended at the start. And by the fourth hour, you're probably losing the will to carry on. Coconut is much more palatable in dal or a flapjack. So vary your academic diet in the same way. One hour of maths, a 10 minute break. An hour of English, a 20 minute break. Media, and so on. You'll keep yourself interested, and each new task will come to feel fresh and interesting, a variation on the previous hour. 